Well, welcome back to Hedrick Wet Shaves, an astronomy talk. We'll be trying out this new blade by Shark. All right, so let's get this shave on the road. The Shark blades come in a single wrapper like that. That's what they look like. And we'll get them loaded up in the Rockwell 2C on setting R3. So there's been all kinds of astronomy stuff I've been looking into on YouTube lately. Okay, let's wet the face. Sometimes my face gets pretty dry, so it's nice to Give it a good wrench there. Can't stay away from this Irish countryside shaving cream. Love it, love it, love it. And somebody had said to kind of push it around in the shaving bowl, just pack it down really good and kind of smear it around. That worked amazing. I mean, I just did a tiny bit. Look at all that. Okay. Well, I'll be talking astronomy in this video here in just a bit. I have a little bit of interesting news. And forgive me because I will be referencing my notes. So, uh, shaving cream going flying and everything else, this could get interesting. <laughs> Anything you guys have been up to lately that hobbies or things you wanted to get into that finally have time for? Or the technology finally caught up with what you're interested in? <laughs> That'd be kind of my experience sometimes all right coming out a little thin on the shaving cream again but that is okay all righty so before we get started i have been interacting with this youtube channel check the link in the description that's just a photo right there if i get my editing software correct Mark D'Antonio in Arizona. His YouTube channel is Sky Tour Live Stream with Mark D'Antonio, S T L S, like you see there. And I was just researching all kinds of things about the Milky Way and Andromeda. Let me get my notes straight here. <laughs> They'll do live imagery of all sorts of things. I'll get into that in a minute. But did you know, a little trivia here. The Milky Way galaxy, they keep, every few years, they keep saying, oh, it's more and more and more. Uh, the last figure I saw was 2 million light years across. That's uh, with 250 billion stars. Uh, that's 2.5 times 10 to the 11th power. In Europe and America, very large numbers will, use, will mean something slightly different when we're saying billion or million. So check into that. That's why I said... Uh, 10 to the 11th power and Andromeda galaxy or otherwise known as M31 is 260,000 light years across over 1 trillion stars and what I mean by that is 1 times 10 to the 12th power maybe I'll leave a little link on a video describing how Europe and America mean different things with large numbers uh, 2,537,000 light years away, so 2.537 million light years away, and it's heading toward us at 300 kilometers a second or about 190 miles per second. But it would take like 5 billion years to reach our galaxy or 5 times 10 to the ninth power. Okay, we are loaded up in the Rockwell Razor with the Shark Blades. Here we go. Sometimes it seems to help when it sets for a while with the shaving cream. Other times uh, it seems like it dries. But this shaving cream always, with the argan oil naturally in it, when you buy it, it has argan oil already in it. It seems to just stay very nice on the face. So what they will do, Dan and Daryl and the people on the team there, 
you'll see in the chat, you can live chat with them as they're showing the sky objects from his 10 inch telescope in Arizona. And I've done that a few times now. And it's just amazing. You can request, oh, I want to look at Andromeda. Or, oh, I, I'd like to see the Pleiades, but it has to be in your sky. Like if you're in the southern skies, they won't be seeing the same thing you're seeing because we're in the northern hemisphere. And they will answer astronomy questions. He, he has an amazing background in astronomy and has all kinds of cool stories that he'll tell. Mr. Mark D'Antonio. And so one of the things I was asking about how fast the stars in the inner part of the galaxy spin, because in our solar system, you know, Mercury, Venus, Earth, Mars, etc. The closer planets like Mercury and Venus to the sun will orbit the sun quicker. Not necessarily with galaxies. Maybe if there's a black hole, they might just spin really quick around the black hole event horizon, you know, at a distance. But our galaxy, it'll just kind of turn like a big disk, you know, uniformly with some drag and other physics involved there. But it's not like the center of the galaxy with all those bright stars just going crazy. Like this picture here of the Andromeda. They actually will share these pictures and you can buy them from them, but you can also use them in content or on Facebook. And that's totally okay with them. It's so awesome because they basically believe that it's our skies. And if you want a high quality print, you can buy it from them. But if you just want to share it for your friends, like I am here, then they're okay with that. It's so awesome. Wet the face again. Take a pause on astronomy. This blade is fantastic. That's from the Razor Company. I actually was asking about, you know, different prices and was told that, hey, you know what? Maybe we'll throw in a couple extra blades for you because another company had a different price on the blades you wanted by a few dollars. So why don't we just, you know, throw in a couple of, of packs. I'm not saying that they'll do that for you because prices fluctuate and so on anyhow, but that was just really nice. The Razor Company, they have such a selection. All right. So I'll join uh, Mark D'Antonio with a live stream. I think I said around 8 p.m. usually, and you can ask questions and and interact, and they'll give you some perspective, and they'll adjust their telescope. Man, that is a nice blade. You may recall I did a sharp blade, but this is a shark blade. If I can show you this. Kind of see that. It's by the Lord Company. And they're known, the Lord Company is known for very smooth blades. Most of them. I think Big Ben might be part of them too. And that one just didn't do it for me. But just, man, that was nice. That was fantastic. Of course, in the Rockwell razors, they seem to just do really well too. Okay. Well, I know I kind of scattered all over the place here between being amazed with that razor blade and talking about astronomy, but there's so much, so much. Again, let me, let me give you that. So it is Mark D'Antonio in Arizona. The YouTube is Sky Tour Live Stream with Mark D'Antonio or STLS. And check out the links in the description uh, related to astronomy and related to you know, how far is a light year? I have a link for that in the description as well. And I can also put a video in the description about how America and Europe may use different powers of 10 when they're saying a billion or large numbers. So look for that as well. Okay, guys, thanks for joining me on Hedrick Wet Shaves. And please join us on Mark's YouTube channel live for live astronomy in the sky, we're talking the Pleiades, Orion, the Horsehead Nebula, 
uh, stars, planets, the moon. You can request something and the telescope, 10 inch telescope just points right to it. It's so awesome. That's something I've always loved and my family has always loved is astronomy. Thanks again for joining me, guys. A little bit of rambling, but I will see you next time. Bye-bye.